all my babies doing? Y'all want to quickly stop in right quick and tell you guys good morning. Y'all are going to hang out with me today. I'm going to do a quick little workout before I get my day going, y'all. As y'all can see, I got my protein shake this morning. Got to drink this to give me a little bit of energy. And yeah, by the way, happy belated Memorial Day to all of you guys, all of y'all families. I hope you guys were safe and y'all enjoyed yourself. But anywho, I'm about to get this day on, you guys. So... Y'all stay tuned, okay? Y'all, I'm up in the road, trying to find me like some cute little sleepers right quick. They playing music up in here, child, so I'm gonna try to come back and forth on the camera, okay?
So I'm just browsing around a little bit up in here, child. I found me two, you know, pajama cute little short sets. That's what I was on the hunt for looking for today. It's like some cute little, you know, pajamas or whatnot in here. But baby dolls, up in the uh, decor section, they ain't got nothing. Look, they still empty. Look at these shelves, y'all. Look, <laughs> look at this shelf right here. Child, I ain't got jack. This is all the, you know, the core little items that they got. They got these little mirrors. And then they got these little mirrors right here. I don't really see too much of this. And this is pretty much it on this little aisle. So child, I don't even get check. Okay, so y'all know those little flower things that go on the curtains, like to hold them, you know, I guess to make them to where if you want them like in a different type of style, y'all know those things that you clip on the curtains and they can like drape up in another type of a way. I don't know if y'all understand what I'm saying, but I was looking for some of those as well. And guess what? Look, they ain't got none of them either, child. <laughs> this is the Ross, y'all, that I came in during, I don't know. I don't know what time that was. But I came in here one time and I told y'all where everything was. This is the same exact raw shot. This is not the one that I went to with my mom. This is another whole location. This is the one that ain't got jack. <laughs> I'm gonna get my tail up out of here, child, because they ain't got nothing. Look, this is all they got in their little furniture section right here. Child, I ain't got nothing. I'm finna go. Girl, when I tell y'all, this Ross right here ain't never got nothing y'all that's why i hate coming over here because they ain't never got nothing that i need child <sighs> overall i still picked up a couple of items from out of there y'all but i didn't get much as y'all can see they didn't close down y'all see this shoe carnival right here they used to be shoe carnival child they done went out of business over here and closed down that's the same shoe carnival that me and my mom went in on my birthday and I didn't vlog that. And uh they didn't close down already. I'm like, dog, I know I ain't been over here in a while, cause she come I ain't even open no more. Mm-mm. Child. I know next time not to come over here. Oh Lord, let me turn this buddy up down. I don't wanna be copyrighted again. Is it a uh, it turned down? Nope. <laughs> Child, wait a minute. I want this radio to start blasting on y'all like it did the last time. <laughs> Woo! I'm trying to turn it down, but let me see. I don't think it's gonna blast on y'all. what I get when I uh, when I make it home or whatever I'm gonna head over here to um, City Trends right quick and see what kind of cute little pajama sets they got cuz I only picked up two from out of there and uh, I was trying to get me like four of them so I'm gonna head on over here to City Trends y'all and uh see what they have i'm gonna drive past that the burlington's too to see if they opened up yet y'all know the new burlington's that i was trying to that i was telling y'all about that they um that they didn't built a new one i'm gonna see how 
they opened up their location yet. They probably ain't. But I'm gonna check and see anyway. Pull this thing down. All right, y'all. Ooh, child, I feel good, baby. I got my little workout on this morning. Got my little cell phone up and handed to a couple stores right quick. Child. Candy poo feeling a little good today. Oh shoot, I don't think. Okay, I'm sorry, babe. <laughs> I can tell you people couldn't even get in. Ooh, here are these cars flying today. They is flying, flying, flying. Lord have mercy. I'm gonna go run up here to see my husband too. He had to work today, child. So I'm gonna go see him. Girl, you is in the wrong lane, baby. Y'all, when I tell y'all these people be out here driving crazy. I'm gonna tell y'all something. Lewis told me this was probably three nights ago. No, actually it was two nights ago. Lewis told me that on his way home, they blocked the street from him even coming like to our house on both sides of the street because it was an accident, y'all, so bad. When I tell y'all this was a bad accident, Lewis had to FaceTime me just to tell me, baby, I can't even come home right now because they got the, the uh, street blocked off and I'm gonna show you this accident. So he FaceTimed me and he was trying to zoom in and show me, it was this one car, y'all. Actually, it was like a three car accident. But he was trying to show me this one car. Y'all is not gonna believe how this car looked. It was two young black boys that was flying because the uh, person that actually saw the accident was talking to my husband. And he was trying to show Lewis pictures of the guy. Actually, it was two guys that were just dead, you know, in the car. Like, they died instantly in this, this accident right here, y'all. So, this car... I don't know how this car got like this, y'all, but the young man that saw the accident, he said that the two little, you know, black young boys was flying so fast, you know, going up the street. Then this 18-wheeler, it was 18-wheeler that was involved, ran head on. How did that happen? But the 18-wheeler ran head on to these young boys, hit them head on, smashed their car in, like, I'm talking about, it was so smashed in, y'all. These young boys heads were split. Like their heads were like, you know how your head be hanging like this? This part of their neck was split. So the head of the body was just, you know, hanging down here. Both of the boys died instantly on the scene. The car that I was telling y'all about was stuck. One of the cars, cause it was three cars. One car hit the truck, 18 wheeler head on. And then it was another car that I guess, I don't know how that car got involved, but that car was just upside down like this in the dirt so it hit so hard that it must have flew up or something and the car must have went like whoop, whoop. <laughs> like i don't know how that happened but it it had to like fly up in the air y'all for it to go down in the dirt like it was i said oh my god how in the world did this happen like i was so like y'all let me tell y'all something when Lewis was showing me the accident, I was just like praying. You know, just you know how you just start praying for people in your head and you just start talking to God and it, it's it's just sometimes when I see stuff like that, just like I was telling y'all about the other accident, about that girl, you know, getting out her car on the expressway, y'all, that type of stuff bothers me because it makes me don't even want to drive. You know what I'm saying? Like sometimes when I get out here and I be driving and stuff like that, I have to be very very cautious pay attention and you know look around me at all times because ain't nobody always watching what they doing when they driving out here they be flying doing all type of stuff i mean on their phone texting child listen i gotta be fully when i tell y'all i gotta be fully oh my phone ring who is this child i gotta be fully you like have an incoming call. paying attention to what's going on because when I tell y'all, these, these call, accidents ain't no joke. Oh, Lord, hold on, y'all. Because I'm going to 
because I'm trying to talk to y'all and get over at the same time. See, this is what I'm talking about. When I'm just distracted like this, phone ringing, <laughs> I'm trying to talk to y'all, trying to get over. Y'all got to pay attention to the road, baby. So now on, because normally I'll be on my phone and stuff like that. And sometimes a lot of y'all be like, Candy hey, Pooh, girl, you better get off that phone. Thank y'all for telling me that because seeing these accidents out here, it make it on you want to talk on the phone and no matter. You just want to just pay attention to the road. Like I said, watch your surroundings and just be watchful. You know what I'm saying? Like, because stuff that's going on nowadays, y'all, I'm talking about me seeing these accidents. I'm shaking my head like, what? And it looks unbelievable. You know what I mean? It, like, it, the accident looks like, how in the world did this happen? Like, I can calmly say that over and over and over, y'all. Like, it scares me sometimes. Like I said, every time I leave my house, I have to anoint myself and pray. There's just something that me and my husband, there's something that we do. Every time I get in my car and I drive off, I have to say a prayer because don't nobody know what's gonna happen out here in these streets. Nobody know. So I have to ask God to continue to cover me, to protect me while I'm out. Like, Lord Jesus, please, bind up all accidents, you know, with me when I'm driving. Keep me, Lord. Keep me safe from all hurt, harm, and danger in the name of Jesus because these people, when I tell y'all, they don't be paying attention I don't know what be going on, but they just don't. So I have to keep myself prayed up and pray and stuff like that before I head out on these roads. Cause it's dangerous. It's dangerous out here, y'all. It, it really is. But anyway, I'ma see y'all as soon as I, uh, actually I'm pulling up now. I'm finna see if this Burlington is open. I'm finna get ready to call my husband right back, y'all. So y'all just hold on for just one little second, okay? Okay, y'all, so this is the new Burlington's right here. And I don't think they open yet. Let me pull up right quick and check and see. It ain't too many, uh, let me see. What this say? It's not open yet, y'all. Grand opening September the 10th. Let me zoom in. Y'all see that? September the 10th. So they not open yet, y'all. So I will be bringing y'all back up here as soon as they open. Yes, I am. Because I definitely want to see what they going to be, you know, putting up in there at this location. Because the last Burlington's I went in, baby dolls, they didn't have nothing at all. Like, ooh, child, let me put this down. Okay. Like y'all, they didn't have nothing up in there. Period. I know they was going, going out of business over there in that location. But anyways, y'all, let me run up in here in this city trends right quick. And I'm gonna see what kind of um little cute pajama sets they got. I was gonna go up in uh that's a TJ Maxx right here. I was gonna go up in that TJ Maxx. I'm trying to think like what do I gotta get out of there because if I go in there I don't want to see nothing that I want and then buy it when Lord knows candy poo don't need nothing <laughs> so when y'all see me buying stuff it's because either I just want it or I'm trying to get something different like pajamas for instance I got a lot of like you know um like lingerie gown pieces that I sleep in. But my husband, my husband told me that uh he wanted me to try to find me a, some cute little short pajama sets. So that's the reason why I'm on the hunt for some of that. So I'm gonna run up in here and see what they got. Right quick. Okay, my baby. So it looks like this is the tree and I got that much stuff either. Y'all see that? They ain't hardly got nothing. You know. Y'all remember these? <laughs> I used to have a pair of these back in the day. Y'all remember these Reeboks? Shall listen. I used to wear them jokers back in the day. 
These are cute right here. Little BB slippers. I think it's cute. Yeah, these are cute. I don't need them slippers though, child. Let me go on over here right quick. I just feel like I got enough shoes in my closet right now. I don't need no more. These are some uh these are some washcloths. Let me see. Mm. These look like dish towels right here. They got uh they got bathroom uh cloths though. I don't know what they look like. I don't know. It could just be me, y'all. I do you like some, like some dish towels or something? I don't know. These are pretty soft. I think I'm gonna get these, y'all, for the uh, just like uh, face cloths. I'm gonna get these right here. I was trying to see if I see some more of them like that. I see more. I'm not eating. I these like these towels. I'm just saying, y'all. These do. If you look at them like close, they look like a uh, dish towel. And I can't find no more of these right here. Mm. Okay, y'all. Let me get left over here, child. I'll be over there looking all day. <laughs> all right, let's go walk over here to the pajama section to see what they got. These some cute little, uh, cute little footy socks that you wear, you know, to keep your feet warm. Let me go on over here first. Let me see what kind of pajamas this they get. This feel like it's gonna be tight. This for the winter time, child. Let me go one right here. These are like, um, pants, though. Let's see. Oh, I hear y'all. That's cute. I'm trying to see what size this is. This is a size. I'm telling y'all some. Your girl is in a size medium and a large now. So I don't wear no extra large or no uh 1x or whatever size i used to wear i used to wear extra large and sometimes i used to get a 1x in certain things because of my hips but child listen baby doll i didn't drop so much weight child i can wear a medium <laughs> yep i can wear a medium y'all Let's see. I think I'm going to get this one right here. I'm trying to see the size on it, though. I'm definitely going to get me a medium. Mm. I just want to be comfy, y'all. I can't sleep, you know, with stuff on too tight and stuff that's not comfortable, if y'all understand what I'm saying. But even these little short sets, these are some, you know, comfortable, like soft material, so I can work with it. But when you sleeping in a whole lot of hot cotton and stuff like that, like, 
Shad, I can't sleep like this. I just can't. <laughs> I gotta be comfortable. I do. Looking at they little uh they little panties over here. Okay, y'all. I'm looking at these socks right quick, y'all. They just like some. Y'all know the little fluffy little socks that you wear. Keep your feet warm. That's all this that these are right here. Alright, y'all. Let me get my little stuff up out of here, child. Uh-oh. What am I running into? Running into something. I'm back, y'all. I am headed to uh, Lewis's Ville job to see him right quick. And uh, see what he up to. He said, I'm folks getting on his nerves, child. I'm trying to figure out what location he at today. I may have to call him back and see right quick. I'm trying to see if he on the left or the right so I know what lane to get in too because it's some, it's some traffic on this little road. <laughs> oh child. I am getting tired. Yes, I am. I'm going to do a little, uh, another little quick haul when I get home, y'all, and show y'all what I picked up at um, Ross and uh, City Trends. I'm just trying to find this, this place where Louis is right now. And I do not see it down this road. Oh my goodness gracious. What? There's a lot of people out there. Wow. I didn't know they was doing that. I thought, uh, you know, when people go to the park and stuff like that, y'all, y'all know like the swings and the slide and stuff like that. I didn't think that they were opening that part up for the kids to go, uh, go over there in that little part of the park and play. Because when me and Lewis was at the park, shooting that little outfit of the day video they had yellow tape around the swing the slide and uh little other little you know equipment you know at the park and stuff like that and the kids could not go over there and play but at this park out here child everybody in their mama over there i'm talking about they swinging they on the slide they on the handlebars i'm talking about what i didn't know they was doing that I guess they didn't open up the park back to the children. I guess. I don't know, child. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, y'all. Oh, this sun is in my face. Lord Jesus. I had to throw my shades on, y'all. Okay. Oh, this parking lot is just too crowded for me. Let me back, back. Let me see who's behind me. And ain't nobody behind me. This is a small parking lot. Like, Jesus. How is people getting around up in here? Child. Wait a minute now. And this man right here just in. Lord, this man that went over the curb, child. I guess he said he gonna get out one way or the other. <laughs> oh, Lord. Where am I finna park it? I really don't want to park because I'm just stopping by seeing my husband right quick. I ain't finna be over here long. I'm trying to see where he didn't park that. I could have parked right here. Let me go over here and park then. These people, child, they'll hit your car and, and act like they ain't hit nothing and keep head on going, child. Oh, yes, ma'am. Come on out, baby. I'm finna get right here in the front. Where is Louisville at? <laughs> Hopefully he see my car. <laughs> oh, 
thank the Lord, I got a spot. I ain't gotta be all over there. Let me text him right quick, y'all. Tell him I'm outside. Okay. So y'all, let me tell y'all something right quick, girl. So how about my mama then went over to Granny's house and she didn't already painted the walls in her living room. So she ain't even try to budge to call me and be like, hey, do you want to go over there and help me paint Granny a uh, living room? Hmm. So how about she went over there early one morning and just left me. She probably figured I was asleep because y'all know I don't wake up to about 12 or 1 in the afternoon. It all depends on how long I stayed up all night long. But child, my mama, she she say she be waking up at seven o'clock in the morning. Lord knows I'm not gonna wake up that early. So my mama probably got up super early one morning, went over to her mama's house and got the paint. So I'm sorry y'all missed that, but I'm gonna go over Granny House so y'all can see like you know the final results of her living room. But she did paint her walls that light gray color. Oh baby, don't hit the side of my car with that dope. Them some Mexican y'all. <laughs> yeah, but she did paint the um both sides of her walls. She painted them that light gray color. So it does look a little brighter up in there, but she still got all of her stuff in there or whatnot. I don't know if she's gonna change none of her decor around, but I'm gonna go over there and let y'all see her walls. Okay. Go my husband. Hello, husband. Oh, the sun. The sun. Can you stand right there? The sun in my face. Can you block? Can you get like right here? Can you get like right here? Yeah. So it won't be in my face. There's Louisville, y'all. Now you see where I'm at. Mm-hmm, because I was lost. <laughs> I had went all the way up there. I said, hold up now, I don't see this stuff. Yeah, I mean, but, um, look how tight it is. That's why I said. Some man over there, he done went he couldn't get out, so he done went over the curb. That's what they do. <laughs> it man said he gonna get out one see, way or the other. He went over the curb. That, see, that's why they had me enforcing this mask on. <laughs> so, see how small the store we is? Mm -hmm. Everybody ain't got no mask on. No, what? If they don't, it just, I, it I, just I, have some people. I had to tell them. And I can't keep up with everybody. Mm hmm. You got your outfit on. You want this little cute little purple outfit? Yeah. Get you. The puts. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I said I was gonna throw this on today. It's real thin due to it being hot out here. Yeah, it's burning hot. Mm-hmm. This little outfit right here real thin. Yeah, no, I know I'm too. I had to throw this on today. Look nice though. Yeah. Thank you, babe. I bought some other pajama suits for you. I'm not gonna share them though. Oh, okay. You'll see them when you get home. I'm gonna do a haul for y'all though. <laughs> I'm ready to go now. You say you ready to go. Mm -hmm. I hate this store. This so you fixed this? Oh, this a new one. This a new one? Mm hmm, it's the same one. I thought you said bro. <laughs> <laughs> So what happened to the thing you had on your neck yesterday? It's in the car. It went down. So, uh -huh. but this battery life stay up longer. So this stay up for 20 hours. Mm. So when it don't work, see, I don't know how to fix this. Look, see how it's broke. Oh, uh, you can put some glue on it. I got some, it's some super glue in the, in, the, uh, that, in the cabinet. This, this work one. At home in the kitchen. Yeah, I had to tell you one. Look, I, I need to step outside for a minute. He said, you in front of the store? I said, yeah. Mm. It's like, I'm in the Alcatraz. They don't want me to go nowhere. <laughs> it don't make no sense. Like, y'all scared. Somebody <laughs> finna come bomb the place. Ooh, see, look, this young man right yeah, here ain't got no mask That's because I missed him. Shoot, he probably went in when I was out here. I, I can't catch everybody. I think, oh, okay. He just, he just pulled up. Yeah, so I can't. This is what I've been telling you about the um, Mexican people. They don't be the problem. They just come in, do their shopping, speak. Hello, security. How you doing? I got it. I got it. I got it. So they don't. They be talking about they mad. Mm -hmm. They got it on. 
They don't have it, but soon as we no, come. No, okay, I see what he doing. Soon as we come in here. He, he went and got his man. Yeah. that old man. Soon as we come in here, the young folks. <laughs> man, bro, I'm going to get it, bro, dang, bro. Like, uh, Talk about them little young black boys. Yeah, I'm like, bro, dude. I should have known. Dude, I didn't gotta have your mind. I got it on, dude. I said you gotta have it over your face. Man, you pit it, you pit it. Man, you know what? Don't worry about it. Just don't you worry about it. <laughs> yeah, he's thin and soft. What she talking about? No, yeah. oh, you still look, at, you is a mess. You still talking about this outfit? Yeah, exactly. Oh, you rub on your legs. It's, it's soft. That's, that's why I got that, that Angel Soul outfit. Mm -hmm, that what outfit? Angel Soul. What I told you I got. I'm trying to remember. I don't know. What I told you, there was two small last time, but I got a large, but this time I got Angel Soul. Mm. These sleeves be kind of acting up. Yeah, we got to have a yard day tomorrow. Well, we I gotta have y'all day because you ain't finna do that much. We sure do, y'all. Another yard day. Yeah. It's been doing a lot of raining and the grass is high again. Should and we try, try to keep it low. She be trying to do out there cut the grass and don't need to cut it because it be too hot and she can't hardly breathe. So. <laughs> I be taking my time, though. Don't matter. Don't matter. It all depends on the weather like this you don't need to cut like this not when it's hot like See, that no that's how i do when it's kind of dim and but you know this morning early early this morning it was kind of cool yeah it was real cool this it was morning. cool outside when I, when I got in the car i turned my heat on you turned your heat on yeah it was cold it was that cool i was cold i'm like dog it's cold so, out here so you don't you don't remember bringing me here now mm -mm. you know mm -mm. Mm -mm. Cause it was like five something in the morning. That's probably why it was still dog outside. So yeah. I couldn't, I couldn't then, remember then the streets and right stuff there. like that. Remember Miss can stay over there. Mm, no black people. Mm -mm. That's amazing. Oh, you gonna buy one? Oh, you gonna buy one? Okay. Chad, I don't know what happened. I don't know if somebody hit a pole. I don't know what happened, but the lights, they just, just, everything just, cut off, just shut off about four, yeah. three in the morning. And then I realized my ceiling fan stopped. And I was telling Lou, and I was like, Lou, the lights turned off, and he got up, went to the door, and he said the whole street was pitch black. Dude, so I was just like, Do you know I ain't ate nothing but them cereal last night? You ain't ate nothing all today? I got some water now. Mm. What, what you doing? You, you, you trying to be on the diet or something like me? I'm losing my stomach because... <laughs> I ain't on your dad. I'm just. <laughs> you ain't on my dad. <laughs> he said he ain't on my dad because you know my dad is rough. Mm -hmm. Candy pool ain't eating. You know she, she, she drinking. That's one of them, <laughs> them crazy dad. I just drink water and put dirt. But even if I do eat, y'all, it be healthy though. But Lewis, he can't. He can't take my dad. It ain't gonna work for him. No, I take the dad home. when I'm fasting. Now we we not talking about fasting. Now this my dad because I can go two three days. But fasting husband is specifically for fasting diet. fasting for things that you're asking God to do. You know, it's mm. not for a diet. You remember I was going two and three days? You talking about you ain't eight? Yeah. Mm. Oh, this sun. No, you need wash. Ain't no shine to it. Come on, my truck. Mm hmm. Need a shine to it. Yeah. I know that big one though. It's kind of dirty. I had, you know, put my little windshield wiper stuff. My window was kind of dingy. Not my window. My windshield was kind of dingy. Where is them things at anyway so, that I supposed to put on the grill? You put them up? They up under the cabinet where nah, the pot's at. They still up under there. Then nobody use those. I, I ain't even using. I still be using my one little pan because I ain't know if you still want to use them. I need to get some, some screws and I'm going to screw them in there. How you gonna do that? Get the screw, get the drill, and screw it. Through the, through the metal? Mm-hmm. I didn't know that work. Yeah, so. So what you gonna do now? I'm probably gonna go to the house. I was gonna go to Granny House so they can see uh, her walls right quick. But 
I'm trying to like see what I want to do because I'm indecisive right now, mm -hmm. y'all. It's 5:38. If you, if you go so. out there, you need to go out there for a dog. You know the, what's going on out there. What's going on out there? Baby. I don't know. Just yesterday, they shot up a marathon right by Green. Mm. Hey, they got this little thing going on so now. Sad. They just shooting up stuff at the gas stations. And you know? I know if I go out there right now, it may be dark by the time I come home. So I they, may not need they to doing go. They're some kind of stuff. Because it's well, 5. That's a thing. It's 540 right now. What's the, what's the, what's like the time out? initiation stuff. Yeah. And there's another one, initiation, that... You got to break in somebody's house while they're at home. What? Yeah. See, you folks finna get killed out here. Let them keep on. I don't know. Where you be getting all this stuff from? That's oh, dangerous. Police. You must forget I talked to police officers. That's the, Ooh, and they talk to the gang members. Because I don't think I saw nothing on news. Not no, they, they don't be on the news. <clears throat> mm. What I'm telling you don't be on the news. Wow. And, uh, mm -hmm. you know, they talk mm -hmm. to them kids that's been oh uh, you got locked up and initiating and stuff like that mm. what happens oh, they, they gonna get hurt out here i'm telling you you can't you can't be breaking nobody house like that that is crazy y'all that so, is so crazy no i may not go to granny's house today then because i know it's gonna be dark by the time i come home and then my little nephew want me to braid his hair but i was just like I don't think I can because my nails too long. Y'all know Julian, he got all the hair on his head. He asked me to braid, braid his hair up for him. And I was just like, auntie can't do it today, babe, because my nails is not gonna let me braid tight enough. I gotta not have on nails, y'all, to do like some. You need some real sanitizer. Some, some, I, some, I uh, ain't never, uh, you some ever, corn roll braids. You ever heard any sanitizer that's sticky? That's sticky. Yeah, it's sticky. No, somebody like, gave you something like that. No, that's what they got in there. It's green. <laughs> and when you put the sanitizer on your hand, it feels sticky. What? I didn't want no. Oh, you tell me that might be that Dollar Tree stuff. Yeah. Is it in a little, little container and it's no, green? It's, a, it's in one like that, but it's green. Maybe they changed out the hand yeah, sanitizer. Because you ain't supposed to have no sticky hand sanitizer in there. It's supposed to be just smooth and just light and liquidy. So, yeah, we got you. Mm -mm. trying to keep y'all out this sun. I still gotta find your anniversary gift. I ain't thought, still ain't thought about nothing. Mm. It, it ain't, I don't, I'm lost this year. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to get you either, but I do got some up my sleeve. No. Y'all. You ain't got no sleeves. I got some up my sleeve for husband. You ain't no sleeve. They cut off. This time. Yes, I do. During the quarantine season, we don't be able to do much. But I got some on my sleeve. I'm ready. Mm. <laughs> Ooh, I'm gonna tell you why I feel like this camera. It's cause this stuff right here on it. This one. It's like, a it, now. Nah, it's a clear. It's a clear thing on it. That's why I look like this. Oh, your battery going down. I see. I'm gonna have to get another battery. I'm gonna get another battery. Um, Give me some sugar and so I'm gone. Goodbye. Um, I love you. I'll see you tonight. I love you too. <laughs> see, it rained and my truck look like it been washed. Huh? That's the color. It rained and it look like my truck been washed on. Mm-hmm. You look like you done wiped the dam or something. No, it do nothing. That's all. Well, that's Let me old change this battery, y'all. Yeah, I'm back. Ooh, Chad, I'm knocking stuff down. This battery is so hot. Oh, let me get this thing. I can't even get it, child. It's the, it didn't fell no. Who knew? Who was the best? <laughs> and little man, he tell little Mexican. <laughs> he can't go in the store right there because he ain't got no mask. <laughs> so I guess he got to stay. I guess he got to stand out. Oh, okay. I see his, uh, I don't know if this is girlfriend or his daughter. She went and got them some masks. Lewis gotta keep them people. Um, the ones that ain't got no masks, he gotta keep them at their store. Oh, they gon' 
I guess they're gonna have to go all the way back to where they was just to get a mask and then come back. Cause Lewis can't let them in the store without no mask. And some people like, if Lewis not watching or whatever, just like he was standing over here with me, some old black dude went in there without one. And then I guess somebody in there told him, you can't be in here without no mask. He came right back outside and got a mask out his truck. Lewis is a mess. Here he come, y'all. He said, can you tell me where I get the gas? Uh huh. Did you tell me where I get the gas? <laughs> what are you talking about, gas? The, the propane. Oh. No, I was trying to show you that old phone booth. Like, <laughs> they need to take that thing down. They sure do. It don't even work, do it? No, ain't no cord on. Oh my gosh. They sure do need to take that mess out the wall. What was this? A mess with his cell. Let me, uh, make my way on to this house y'all i was gonna take y'all to um granny house right quick but baby doll since lewis just told me what he told me which i did not know nothing about that hmm. it ain't no sense of me going out there because i know i'm gonna stay over granny house to talk to her for a good minute and it's gonna be dark by the time i leave because it's already it's gonna be six o'clock so, if I go on over there now, I know I'll probably be leaving probably around about, about 8. And I think it gets dark at 8 o'clock. I'm going to turn around and go back this way. Because I don't like going this way, the way that I came. Lewis actually had me going a long way. Since I know how to get over here now, because I sure don't remember bringing him up here. I just don't remember. Child. <clears throat> and I don't like going down these little back streets now. Mm -mm. Let me turn around. I'm trying to see what other street I can get on right quick. Darn, I ain't gonna be able to turn right there. Because I don't know what's down this road, child. I'm gonna get my little self lost going up this street. And Memphis is so small. To be honest with y'all, girl, you can't even get lost. <laughs> I bet you when I get down here, I'm gonna be like, oh, okay, I know where I'm at. <laughs> Cause Memphis is a small place. So, let me just see, cause I will gonna turn around, but I'm gonna see when I get down, what, what street this is. <sighs> it's a little pleasant though down this road. Marquis's best friend, he stay one down one of these streets. He sure do. He stay down one of these roads. This is what Lewis was talking about. Lil Haran. That's Marquis's best friend, y'all. Lil Haran. He stay over here somewhere. I was just trying to figure out where I was, but I know where I'm at now. I'm about to make my way on to the house, y'all. So I'm gonna see y'all as soon as I can get there. Okay. Get this door open right quick. 
I wonder what Jamaya in here doing. Whew, ain't no telling, child. Ain't no telling. Ooh, it's hard to open my door. Sound like this thing getting stuck or something. Hold on, y'all, because I know it's kind of dark up in here. Wait a minute, y'all. All right, y'all, I'm back. I know it's yellow, y'all. I know it's yellow, child. Hopefully this camera start acting right and not being orange. Oh, it's gonna close my door. I'm gonna leave my door open. Okay. Let me wash my hands right quick. do a little haul right quick and let y'all see what I picked up at uh, Ross and uh, City Trans. Probably gonna sit in here in my living room. Let me turn this on so y'all can see. Okay. Big. Yeah, I'm probably gonna sit right here in my living room, y'all, because I know it's kind of dark. It's dark everywhere. Okay, hold on, y'all, right quick, okay? Babies, I'm back, child. Had to give me a little lemon water. It's so refreshing. Okay, I'm gonna sit this right here. Okay, let me turn this light off, this hallway light off. Turn my lamp on. All right, y'all. Okay. <sighs> Let me just release all of the heat that was just outside. And let me just feel the cool breeze right now, y'all, before I get started. Okay? <laughs> all right, y'all. Let me sit y'all. I'm going to sit y'all lit. I'm gonna sit y'all right here on my on my table. Okay, can y'all see me? Is it a little dark? I hope not. I'm gonna sit right here. Whew. Cause I believe if I sit in that chair, y'all ain't gonna be able to see me that good. I don't know. All right, so we're gonna start with city trends first. Actually, I'm gonna see if I can come up just a little bit y'all can see all right can y'all see me okay so of course y'all saw me when i picked up these towels these are some uh they're just a six pack of washcloths and y'all know why i got them right they want number 2.99 girl look at their price oh i was hoping i could find another one like this that was 2.99 but this is the only one that i saw so picked up that and then, of course, y'all saw me get this little cute little short set right here. This is just the top. And this is a size medium. Yes. And these are the little shorts right here. Super cute. Then I picked up me some cute little footies in case, uh, you know, just to put on when your feet cold. And these were $1.99, so I couldn't beat that price. Got those. And then I picked up another pair, and these were the same price. That's what they look like. Okay, so that's all I got from uh, from uh, City Trends. Alright, Ross. 
So I picked up this cute little short. What size is this one? This is a large right here, y'all. It's a large. So I picked up this one. Let's see. This was ten dollars. And this shirt says, Lord, give me the strength. Y'all know that's what I say all the time when I walk in the house. Lord, give me the strength. So this is super cute. I like that little night. And then I picked up this one here. And this is in a size medium. This one was uh, uh, $10 as well. This is just a shirt. This is what the back looks like. And these are the little shorts right here. And then I picked up me some more uh, slippers. Found these. Y'all got so many slippers, child. I just wanted another pair because I'm always washing the ones that I have. Because sometimes I'll like go outside in them and check the mailbox and come back in the house and then I'll wash them so much. The bottom part of them they may tend to tear up, but I switch them out from time to time. So, child, listen, I was just like, I needed a pink pair because I know I got a pink robe. So I was just like, I needed a pink pair and these are cute. And these were number $7.99, y'all. So they weren't bad at all. So I'm pretty sure these feel real good on. Especially when you just hopping out the shower and you want some soft house shoes on. I bet them feel so cozy. But yes, that's all I picked up from Ross and City Trends. Let me just check and see. Let me see. Oh, y'all, wait a minute now, child. Wait a minute. I, I got one more little bag in here. I had picked up me some glasses from City Trends. They were two ninety nine, dollars y'all. $2.99. This is what they look like. They just some cute little clear glasses made like the ones I got on but these are actually shades but these are like glasses so I'm just like yeah I'm feeling these let me go ahead and just get these pick these up and I ain't number 2 dollars baby I had to get them <laughs> all right y'all let me try to get my little self up right quick <laughs> Lemon water could be real sour at times, y'all. That's if y'all not used to it, but I'm so used to it. I drink it a lot. It's like, I could just drink it like it's regular water. Even though it's sour, I can just drink it like regular water. But it just tastes so good to me because I'm so used to it. And it's like that lemon, that lemon flavor. It makes my stomach feel good, y'all. So that's the reason why I drink it like a lot. I do. I drink it with meals. I drink it for lunch. <laughs> I drink it at nighttime. Even when I'm at the restaurants when me and Louis used to be out, I'm always getting lemon water because it just feels so good on my stomach for some reason. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> mm. well, that's the reason why I drink it. And then another thing about lemon water is that it helps with the body and it breaks down a lot of unnecessary fat that's in the stomach. It breaks it down. So, I can drink this all day. Okay, let me see if I can get my little self up, y'all. Woo! Child. All right, babies. <laughs> all right, y'all. Let me turn some lights back on since I'm entering to the kitchen. I knew it was something else I wanted to share with y'all. I went to the grocery store the other day to pick up me just some some items. And um, I picked up me some organic uh, chips. I found some organic chips for me to like snack on because I wanted something different because y'all know how I am. Sometimes I'll get tired of eating like cashews and almonds even though, look y'all. Yeah, I'm darn near ate this whole bag. And I almost ate the whole bag of almonds and then I got another whole bag of cashews right here. But 
I went up in Kroger and I found me some organic chips, y'all. So I grabbed me some of these right here. And they're the cheddar and sour cream. And I was looking at the back of it. This is uh, 150 milligrams of sodium, zero sugar, two grams of fiber, and it got 150 calories in it. <laughs> oh, excuse me. So I don't know if that's good or bad, but I think these aren't too bad for me to eat, you know? They're not like the ordinary greasy, you know, chips that I used to eat, like Doritos and hot chips and stuff like that I used to eat. This is a little bit more less fattening. So that's the reason why I purchased me some chips. And then I grabbed me some of this at, at uh, Kroger as well. Actually, no, I picked this up at, uh, at Walmart, y'all. I got this from Walmart. And these are some extreme wellness high fiber uh, wraps. And it says 100% whole wheat and flax seed on it right there. So I just want to try these. And this right here has 11 grams of dietary fiber. This only has 50 calories. Uh, this is 4 grams of net carbs. Extra virgin olive oil zero grams of trans fat no sugar added and no high generic is it high generic hydrogenated oils and i hope i'm saying it right but as y'all can see that right there on the side of the packet what i just read this is pretty much the wraps that i'll be doing since i found some that's you know, I think that's gonna do me some justice. So I got me some of those. Let me see what else I picked up. Okay, so I picked up me some, um, I got some raisin bran. Cause I wanted me some raisin cereal. And then, um, oh, I picked up me some more kind of eggs, y'all. We picked up these right here from the fresh side market. They like some brown eggs. So I ran out of eggs. So I picked up some of those. And then I, got, I grabbed me one of these juices right here. This is the Santa Cruz Organic Lemonade. Have y'all tried this before? I think I have like a long, long, long time ago. But I don't remember how this tastes. So I just grabbed me another one of those. And then, I'm trying to see what else I picked up, y'all. I picked up me some turkey burgers. So I know one of y'all was like, Candy Pool, you can eat turkey burgers, girl. So I picked up me some of these right here. And guess what else I found, child? Just guess what else I found. Y'all guess it. A lot of y'all also was telling me to try something that I didn't know nothing about. Let me open up this other freezer. Y'all was like, Candy, you know instead of just eating chicken, cut up uh, grilled chicken, you can get you some, um, some ground turkey or some ground chicken. I didn't know nothing about ground chicken. Nothing at all, y'all. But I found it. I'm trying to see if I could find it. I don't know if it's in. Okay, let me go back over here. Because I didn't see it over here in this freeze. <laughs> let me see. Oh, here it is, child. I don't know how I overlooked this. Mm. But I found me some ground chicken, y'all. First time ever trying this right here. So it says great for tacos, chili, and burgers. Mmm. I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna use this for. I'm probably gonna use it for maybe try it on on a soft taco with one of those flaxseed wraps. I may do a little bit of this in one of those wraps. And then I also may um let's see what else I can do with this. 
what else I can put it in? I have to get on YouTube and see what kind of recipes that I can use for the ground chicken. But I know I probably do it in a taco and see what that tastes like. Cause y'all know I was cutting up my little chicken breast, putting it in a taco. And then, you know, I got some more of these shells right here. So I can cook that ground chicken up and put it in one of these taco shells and see what it tastes like. Throw a little bit of uh, spinach in there. And I still got some more of this sauce right here so I can add this sauce for my little topping or whatever. And then throw me some organic cheese on it and see how that tastes. But your girl been, you know, she been thinking about some new recipes and stuff like that and trying to get some new food ideas. But you know, I also be on uh, one of my subscriber channels as well. I'm gonna leave her name somewhere in the video. She be doing like some really healthy like meals y'all so i be heading on over there you know to her channel to see what she cooked up because she be doing some healthy type stuff so hmm. i be over there seeing what she cooking in her kitchen child because i know i'm gonna try that uh that uh that fried rice that healthy fried rice she made and then she had made some type of wrap too and i wanted to try that but she got some pretty nice healthy recipes on her channel. And uh I'm trying some of her recipes soon. Yep, I may make it a little different, but I'm gonna try some of them. Okay. I'm trying to see what I gotta do with my beauty room. I know I got stuff down here all over the floor and stuff like that, but Oh, oh Lord, let me turn some lights off. Cause if I'm finna sit in this booty room for a minute, I'm gonna have to first off turn off some of these lights cause I ain't up in here no more. Okay. Oh y'all, y'all see my little my little plant right there? I put it back on the on the coffee table, child. I took it away from over by the TV. I'm just like, no. Nah. I'll sit it on the coffee table. Okay, let me turn this light off too. Right quick, so I'm finna go on in here, y'all. Okay. Jemiah, she in there laying down. All right. Whew. Okay, babies. All right. I was gonna turn on my light, but I don't even know I see my lamp in here. I don't even see my lamp in here at all. Oh, <sighs> child. Let me look at this closet. Cause I don't want it to be too dark in here for y'all. Let me see y'all. Let me see my lamp, my lamp in here right quick. Let me try to pull this up right quick. All righty, y'all. Y'all see me? Okay. All right. Now, I got my babies. I'm back, child. Had to give me a little lemon water. It's so refreshing. Okay, I'm gonna sit this right here. Let me turn this light off, this hallway light off. Turn my lamp on. All right, y'all. Okay. <sighs> Let me just release all of the heat that was just outside. And let me just feel the cool breeze right now, y'all, before I get started, okay? <laughs> All right, let me sit y'all. I'm gonna sit y'all there. I'm gonna sit y'all right here on my on my table. Okay, can y'all see me? Is it a little dark? I hope not. I'm gonna sit right here. Whew. Cause I believe if I sit in that chair, y'all ain't gonna be able to see me that good. I don't know. All right, so we're gonna start with city trends first. Actually, I'm finna. See if I can come up just a little bit so y'all can see. All right, can y'all see me? 
Okay, so of course, y'all saw me when I picked up these towels. These are some, uh, they're just a six pack of washcloths. And y'all know why I got them right. They want number $2.99, girl. Look at their price. Who I was hoping I could find another one like this that was $2.99, but this is the only one that I saw. So, picked up that. And then, of course, y'all saw me get this little cute little short set right here. This is just the top. And this is a size medium. Yes. And these are the little shorts right here. Super cute. Then I picked up me some cute little footies in case, uh, you know, just to put on when your feet cold. And these were $1.99. So I couldn't beat that price. Got those. And then I picked up another pair. And these were the same price. That's what they look like. Okay, so that's all I got from uh from uh City Trends. Alright, Ross. So I picked up this cute little short besides this one. This is a large right here, y'all. It's a large. So I picked up this one. Let's see. This was $10. And this shirt says, Lord, give me the strength. Y'all know that's what I say all the time when I walk in the house. Lord, give me the strength. So this is super cute. I like that little nightie. And then I picked up this one here. And this is in a size medium. This one was uh, uh, $10 as well. This is just a shirt. This is what the back looked like. And these are the little shorts right here. And then picked up me some more uh slippers found these yeah i got so many slippers child i just wanted another pair because i'm always washing the ones that i have because sometimes i'll like go outside in them and check the mailbox and come back in the house and then i'll wash them so much the bottom part of them they may tend to tear up but i switch them out from time to time so child listen i was just like i needed a pink pair because i know i got a pink robe so i was just like i need the pink pair and these are cute and these were number 7.99 y'all so they weren't bad at all so i'm pretty sure these feel real good on um, especially when you just hopping out the shower and you want some soft house shoes on i bet them feel so cozy but yes that's all i picked up from ross and City trends. Let me just check and see. Let's see. Oh, y'all, wait a minute, that child. Wait a minute. I, I got one more little bag in here. I had picked up me some glasses from City Trends. They were two ninety nine, y'all. Two ninety nine. This is what they look like. They just some cute little clear glasses made like the ones I got on. But these are actually shades. But these are like glasses. So, I was just like, yeah, I'm feeling these. Let me go ahead and just get these. Pick these up. And I ain't number two ninety nine. Baby, I had to get them. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let me try to get my little self up right quick. <laughs> Lemon water could be real sour at times y'all that's if y'all not used to it but i'm so used to it i drink it a lot it's like i could just drink it like it's regular water even though it's sour i can just drink it like regular, regular water because i'm like dog why am i drinking this like this water and i know this the sour is i don't know what but it just tastes so good to me because i'm so used to it and it's like that lemon that lemon flavor, it makes my stomach feel good, y'all. So that's the reason why I drink it like a lot, I do. I drink it with meals, I drink it for lunch, <laughs> I 
I drink it at nighttime. Even when I'm at the restaurants, when me and Louis used to be out, I'm always getting lemon water because it just feels so good on my stomach for some reason. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> mm. well, that's the reason why I drink it. And then another thing about lemon water is that it helps with the body and it breaks down a lot of unnecessary fat that's in the stomach. It breaks it down. So I can drink this all day. Okay, let me see if I can get my little self up, y'all. Woo! Yeah. Oh, Lord. Okay. All right, babies. <laughs> Mm. all right y'all let me turn some lights back on since i'm entering to the kitchen i knew it was something else i wanted to share with y'all i went to the grocery store the other day to pick up me just some some items and um i picked up me some organic uh chips i found some organic chips for me to like snack on because I wanted something different because y'all know how I am. Sometimes I'll get tired of eating like cashews and almonds even though, look y'all. Child, I'm darn near ate this whole bag. And I almost ate the whole bag of almonds and then I got another whole bag of cashews right here. But I went up in Kroger and I found me some organic chips, y'all. So I grabbed me some of these right here. And they're the cheddar and sour cream. And I was looking at the back of it. This is uh, 150 milligrams of sodium, zero sugar, two grams of fiber, and it got 150 calories in it. <laughs> oh, excuse me. So I don't know if that's good or bad, but I think these aren't too bad for me to eat, you know? They're not like the ordinary greasy, you know, chips that I used to eat, like Doritos and hot chips and stuff like that I used to eat. This is a little bit more less fattening. So that's the reason why I purchased me some chips. And then I grabbed me some of this at, at uh, Kroger as well. Actually, no, I picked this up at, uh, at Walmart, y'all. I got this from Walmart. And these are some extreme wellness high fiber uh, wraps. And it says 100% whole wheat and flax seed on it right there. So I just wanted to try these. And this right here has 11 grams of dietary fiber. This only has 50 calories. Uh, this is four grams of net carbs, extra virgin olive oil zero grams of trans fat no sugar added and no high generic is it high generic hydrogenated oils and i hope i'm saying it right but as y'all can see that right there on the side of the packet what i just read this is pretty much the wraps that i'll be doing since i found some that's you know, I think that's going to do me some justice. So I got me some of those. Let me see what else I picked up. Okay. So I picked up me some, um, I got some raisin bran. So I wanted me some raisin cereal. And then, um, oh, I picked up me some more kind of eggs, y'all. I picked up these right here from the fresh side market. They're like some brown eggs. Some ran out of eggs. So I picked up some of those. And then I, got, I grabbed me one of these juices right here. This is the Santa Cruz Organic Lemonade. Have y'all tried this before? I think I have like a long, long, long time ago. But I don't remember how this tastes. So I just grabbed me another one of those. And then, I'm trying to see what else I picked up, y'all. I picked up me some turkey burgers. So I know one of y'all was like, Candy Pool, you can eat turkey burgers, girl. So I picked up me some of these right here. 
And guess what else I found, child? Just guess what else I found. Y'all don't guess yet. A lot of y'all also was telling me to try something that I didn't know nothing about. Let me open up this other freeze. Y'all was like, Candy, you know instead of just eating chicken, cut up uh, grilled chicken, you can get you some um, some ground turkey or some ground chicken. I didn't know nothing about ground chicken. Nothing at y'all, nothing. Nothing at all, y'all. But I found it for y'all. Trying to see if I could find it. I don't know if it's in. Okay, let me go back over here. Because I didn't see it over here in this freeze. <laughs> let me see. Oh, here it is, child. I don't know how I overlooked this. Mm. But I found me some ground chicken, y'all. First time ever trying this right here. So it says, great for tacos, chili, and burgers. Mmm. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to use this for. I'm probably going to use it for maybe try it on, on a soft taco with one of those flaxseed wraps. I may do a little bit of this in one of those wraps. And then I also may, um, let's see what else I can do with this. What else I can put it in. I have to get on YouTube and see what kind of recipes that I could use for the ground chicken. But I know I probably do it in a taco and see what that tastes like. Because y'all know I was cutting up my little chicken breast, putting it in a taco. And then, you know, I got some more of these shells right here. So I can cook that ground chicken up and put it in one of these taco shells and see what it tastes like. Throw a little bit of uh, spinach in there. And I still got some more of this sauce right here so I can add this sauce for my little topping or whatever. And then throw me some organic cheese on it and see how that tastes. But your girl been, you know, she been thinking about some new recipes and stuff like that and trying to get some new food ideas. But I also be on, on, um, um, But you know, I also be on uh, one of my subscriber channels as well. I'm gonna leave her name somewhere in the video. She be doing like some really healthy like meals, y'all. So I be heading on over there, you know, to her channel to see what she cooked up. Cause she be doing some healthy type stuff. So, hmm. I be over there seeing what she cooking in her kitchen, child. Cause I know I'm gonna try that, uh, that uh that fried rice that healthy fried rice she made and then she had made some type of wrap too and i wanted to try that so she got some pretty nice healthy recipes on her channel and uh i'll be trying some of her recipes soon yep i may make it a little different but i'm gonna try some of them okay trying to see what I got to do in my beauty room I know I got stuff down here all over the floor and stuff like that but oh oh lord let me turn some lights off because if I'm gonna sit in this beauty room for a minute I'm gonna have to first off turn off some of these lights because I ain't up in here no more okay oh y'all y'all see my little my little plant right there, I put it back on the on the coffee table, child. I took it away from over by the TV. I'm just like, no. Nah. I'll sit it on the coffee table. Okay, let me turn this light off too. Right quick, so I'm finna go on in here, y'all. Okay. Jemiah, she in there laying down. All right. Whew. Okay, babies. All right. I was going to turn on my light, but I don't even see my lamp in here. I don't even see my lamp in here at 
Oh. Oh, <sighs> child. Let me look in this closet. Because I don't want it to be too dark in here for y'all. Let me see y'all. Let me see my lamp. My lamp in here right quick. Okay. I'm back. Oh, Lord Jesus. Give me the strength and help me, Lord. Help me, help me, help me, Lord. Help me. Let me try to pull this up right quick. All righty, y'all. Can y'all see me? Okay. All right. Now, I got two wigs <laughs> that I will be giving away to whoever, to whoever want them. Okay. I went in my wig bin the other night and I was just like, I'm constantly getting like new units and reviewing them on my other channel. If you guys have not checked out my other channel, my wig reviews, purse reviews, head on over there, link down in the description box and y'all won't miss neither one of my hair reviews or my purse or clothing hauls, etc. Y'all won't miss them. Okay. But I got some wigs that I was just throwing in the boxes. I was just like, okay, I'm not going to wear this no more. I'm not going to wear this no more. I'm not going to wear this no more. So I'm going to share with you guys a couple of wigs that I will be just tossing that I don't want anymore. So it's either I'm going to um, give them to you guys or I'm just going just gonna to toss them because I did contact the women's shelter here, here in Memphis and they're not accepting wigs and stuff like that due to the COVID-19. They're not accepting clothes, nothing, not here in Memphis. Now, I know a lot of y'all was telling me to give my wigs and clothes to the women's shelter, but baby, I'll listen. They're, excuse me, there really isn't anybody at the shelters at this time due to, you know, the COVID-19. They're not allowing a lot of people to be in one big room, not here in this state because I call and that just was said and they said they're not accepting any type of items at this time i'm just like mm, okay so mm. i said well i'm gonna ask my subscribers do y'all want some of these wigs now these wigs have been worn they are pretty old but they don't look real old so you guys can um diy these wigs y'all can wash them y'all can revamp them y'all can do whatever y'all want i'm just not keeping them anymore and if y'all don't want them hey i'm just gonna have to toss them simple as that because i'm constantly like i said constantly getting new wigs in and stuff like that and i'm just like running out of wig space i'm running out of spaces to put my new bags and stuff like that so yeah let me get these wigs y'all Okay, y'all so i'm just gonna share with you guys what the wig is i'm gonna show y'all how the wig looks and if y'all want one y'all just make sure y'all dm me on instagram or i'll put my email down below in my description box you guys can email me and let me know if y'all want these these wigs now so um Whatever y'all like, y'all just let me know. DM me, email me, and hey, I'll send it out to you. Okay? So the first wig that I have, and I did take all the wigs out of the box. So they're not in the box. They are in these little plastic bags right here that I put them in. And um, I'm just going to take them out and just share with y'all what wig it is. So this first wig, this is the Model Model Premium 7 Star Lace Front. So this is basically what she looks like, but I didn't get her in this green color. This is the color that I got her in, y'all. This is pretty much how she looks right here. Let me get my brush so I can brush her down for y'all so y'all can see 
what she looks like. Okay, so mind the little baby hairs that I made up here in the front. Like y'all could do something with this, you know, if y'all want to. It's just a little baby hairs that I made, you know, when I was wearing a wig. But pretty much this is what she looks like. She is a bob and she's like a two-tone color with burgundy at the bottom. And yeah, so whoever want her, let me know. It may take a little minute now, y'all. <laughs> okay, so then we have um now this wig here. This is in the original um bag that, that she came in. This is the Lace Front Premium Synthetic Wig Bobby Boss um, MLF129 Aura. Aurea in the color FF4399. So this is what she looks like. Okay, so she is big, just like that. And I did get her in the same exact color as the model for the picture I just showed y'all okay so this is pretty much what she looks like and this is some natural textured like thick hair like I rarely like wore her y'all so she is you know pretty big so this is basically what she looks like right here okay so y'all want her let me know and I'm telling y'all this is like a more natural type curl kind of big and I don't know if you guys can see that hair pattern really good but this is like some really like I'm not gonna say what well, I am gonna say yakky some yakky like natural textured blowout hair. That's pretty much what this looks like. And it is big just like the picture. Okay. You just got to comb out the curls the way you want to. And you know. Make her work for your liking. Okay. So. Moving forward to the next one. Okay y'all. So the next unit we have is this is Impressed Lace Tressa and this is in the color 1B30. This is what she looks like right here. Okay. Let me go ahead and take the Okay, so this is pretty much what she looks like. Let me brush her out real quick. I really don't want to brush her out too much. What I got on her? Hold on, y'all. I think I got like a little, because I had a tied up when I had her on. I had a tied up just a little bit. Okay. Okay, so... Let me scoot back so y'all can see her real good. This is what she looks like. And she is pretty long too, y'all. Okay. So. That's what she looks like in the front. Okay. And these are the curls. Right here. So this is um, Tressa. So whoever wants Tressa, <laughs> y'all let me know. Whoever wants her. Okay. So this is the other unit here. Moving forward. Alright y'all, the next wig I have is I'll try Lace Front Zen. I know y'all remember Zen. I can't believe I still got her, y'all. This is in the color DR613. So this is a blondie right here. Okay. I don't know if y'all like the rock blonde. But 
she is a blondie because y'all know i be rocking my blondes let me comb her through right quick y'all but zen y'all zen pretty cute she she pretty cute but this is what she looks like okay and she does have dark roots up here it's like a brown color but this is pretty much what she looks like so if anybody wants zen let me know and some of these wigs y'all they're not gonna have the net you know on them i'm just gonna put them in a plastic bag and give y'all the stock card and ship them out to y'all okay so that's pretty much what i'm gonna do when i ship them out because some of these wigs y'all share the nets like you know tore up on them so i'm just like I ain't even gonna worry about no net i'm just gonna you know put them in a plastic bag and just ship them out just like that okay so moving forward we have um I'll trade lace front. Who is she? Irene. So we have Irene, and this is in a color DR30. Okay, almost similar to the to the wig I got on, but this is like real human hair, and this is synthetic. So let me show y'all Irene right quick. This is pretty much what Irene looks like okay so she's just a curly curly unit all the way around y'all can do whatever y'all want to do to her y'all can cut her y'all can put some you know water conditioner or whatever to like wetten up the curls um some satin mousse however y'all can do whatever y'all want to do with this unit right here okay but this is pretty much what she looks like. And this is the top part of the unit. It gives you like dark, dark brown roots up there. Okay. Moving forward. Let's see. We have the Cloud Nine Dream Moose um Isabella we have her okay and I got her in the color 1B this is pretty much what she looks like I'm gonna brush her out for y'all And when I brush her out, y'all, that means these curls are not as tight as if you're getting her brand new. So I'm just letting y'all know, okay? So y'all can still, like I said, do whatever y'all want to do. Y'all can re revamp them, wash the wigs if y'all want to, restyle them, whatever y'all want to do. But this is pretty much what she looks like here, okay? And this is what the top looks like, what the inside looks like. Okay. So, moving forward to the next one. Okay, so we have Free Truth Equal Simply. Simply is one of the oldest, oldest units that I've had for a very long time, y'all. And wait a minute, the color on this one is in the OP61327. So she is a blondie. And I must say, y'all, simply when I first got her, she was really, really cute. But you know, as time flew by, it seemed like she tend to get thin. But this is some really good like hair, y'all. This is like some really good hair. Like it doesn't tangle. Y'all see that? Y'all see how I can just brush clean through her? Now she may tend to shed, you know, just a little bit, but she's still cute. 
you know and it's not a whole lot of hair on this cap it's just enough so it's not real thick you know but this is pretty much what the what the inside of the cap looks like right here and it only gives you one comb so whoever gets this june and y'all be like chaz only one comb at the top that's because that's how the wig came and that's how she was made with one comb over here to your right and then it gives you a comb down there at the bottom okay but you do have that natural part though you have that natural part up there it's pretty much what it looks like y'all can add y'all foundation concealer whatever in that part and y'all good to go but she's a pretty nice you know uh yakky texture natural hair she doesn't tangle at all not in my opinion because it's like this just some some natural you know straight hair look like you just got a, a relaxer i'm just saying <laughs> so this is some pretty nice hair y'all she just may shed just a little bit but this is a nice wig so if you guys want simply let me know and this is what the stock card looks like again right here and i will be putting down um all of these wigs in my description box so you guys know what wig that you want when you dm me or you email me make sure you guys put the pacific wig you know her name and stuff like that so i'll know which one to send y'all okay so i will put down every wig that i'm sharing down below in my uh description box for y'all okay so let's see what else we got here this is the newborn free magic lace mlc 180 uh what is her name though i guess her name i don't know because it don't say it just says magic lace curve part 180 in a color 1b so i'm just gonna show this to y'all because she don't have a name or nothing like that so that's pretty much what she looks like and this hair is also like a really thick like boofy you know natural textured hair almost kind of kinky in my opinion but not too kinky and it's it's like a very thick like i don't know but the texture on this hair y'all is not straight it's almost like um it's almost like the texture hair I showed y'all. Let me see. Right here. It's almost like this. But this is in a color 1B. Okay. So this hair here is really, really thick, y'all. She's a boofy, a very boofy unit. I'm just letting y'all know that she is. Now, I'm not going to get the brush and brush her out or nothing like that because the way that this hair is y'all let me close y'all see the texture like this texture is not it's not on like a natural like i don't know like perm press type of texture like i said it's it's one of these like thick thick boofy textures and y'all can look at the look at the stock car y'all see how big that look on her that's pretty much how this unit is gonna look when you put her on she's gonna look kind of big so i don't want to mess up the texture or the curls on her so i'm not going to comb her out or nothing like that y'all could do whatever y'all want to do to her whenever whoever wants her but this is pretty much what she looks like okay this is the parting and this is how the inside of the cap looks so yeah whoever wants magic lace curve part 180 let me know so the next unit y'all okay let's see what she is this is the natural super flow deep part lace wig the visa in the color 1b i'm giving her away and this is what the visa is looking like y'all let me brush her right quick so y'all get get a good look at, at the hair let's 
So as y'all can see, she's also pretty long too. Okay, this is what the parting looks like in the inside of the cap. So yeah, whoever wants, um, what's her name, the visa, let me know. Okay, next week we got y'all. We have this is the Bobby Boss um, M MLF. 306 China. This is what she looks like. Okay, and I got her in the color TT41224. And this is pretty much what she looks like. Let me calm her out real quick. And this is the color on her. Okay. That's how the parting looks. The cap. I'm trying to see what that was. That's the Bobby Boss sign in there. And this is pretty much what she looks like, y'all. Okay. So whoever wants Bobby Boss um, China, let me know. All right. So we got... Um, Okay, this is the MLC 200, excuse me, Magic Lace Curve Part 200, and this is what she looks like. And I got her, wait a minute, let me see what color I got her in. I got her in the color DYX1B Brown, okay? And this is pretty much like a blunt cut unit, y'all. To where she is cut like straight, you know, and this is like a, a silky texture, but this is what she looks like right here. Okay, she's already cut blunt, that's how she looks. That's the parting on her. Okay, so this is pretty much what the inside of the cap looks like. And this is her, y'all. Right here. Okay. So, if y'all want her, let me know. Alright, y'all. So, next we have... Let's see. This is the U-Shape Lace Wig Silk Base Lace Part MLUH103. And this is premium. This is actually the blended premium human hair. So it actually got a little bit of, you know, human hair in her. And I did get her in a color 1B, but this is what the stock car looks like right here. I don't have, I guess, the stock card of the woman modeling the unit but however babies <laughs> y'all still can let me know if y'all want to or not okay so this is pretty much what she looks like let me calm her down right quick this is just like a natural straight kind of like a silky texture you know long black unit and i believe this is like maybe 18 or 20 inches long because she is pretty long y'all okay that's how long she is and this is the parting don't mind the little baby hairs i created up there at the top y'all as y'all can see them little baby hairs and this is what the inside of the cap looks like this is really like a fake scalp so the scalp do look you know real as y'all can see but overall, this is a pretty nice unit, y'all. And um, let me know if y'all want to. Okay. So, I think that's pretty much it, y'all. That's all that I have for right now. Yeah. That's pretty much it. So, I will jot down all of the wigs that I share with you guys. And if y'all want, you know, one, just one, ladies. 
DM me or email me and let me know and I will ship it off to you guys. Make sure if you guys want the wig, when you, whenever you email me, send me your P.O. box or your address and I'll ship it off to y'all. Okay? So, that's pretty much it with all of the wigs that I have that I am currently giving away at this moment. And I got two more things that I would like to give away as well. Two more things, okay? Actually, let me see, did I did I put them in here? Y'all, Lord knows I be having stuff everywhere, child. Let me look in my closet right quick to see if I got one of the items in here. Okay, y'all, so y'all remember this, this bag here? I had it this plan over there at a point of time, but I took it away from over there and I sat in the closet and I was just like, I'm not even telling this, so I'm gonna give it away. But, I'm giving this one away. So, whoever wants this blue bag, I'm definitely shipping it out to one of you ladies if y'all want it. And I just got some newspaper in here, you know, just to keep it from uh, getting wrinkled all up and stuff like that. So, in case y'all want to know, it's just newspaper and stuff like that. And this type of stuff right here in the inside of it. Okay. So, I will be giving this away to whoever want this royal blue bag. I'll be giving that away as well. And I believe I have another bag that I'll be giving away. Hold on, y'all. Let me go try to find her. I'll be right back. Okay, hey, girl, I'm back. <laughs> y'all, I have to go digging, child. Okay, so I finally found two more bags that I will be giving away. I had to go dig in my bin in Jemiah's room that I had stuff in there, just stuff that, you know, just all over the place, just yeah, stuff that I'm not using and that I don't want no more. So here's the other bag here that I'll be giving away as well. It's made like this one. It's just a different color. So I'll be giving this away to whoever wants her. Okay, now there's a little bit of newspaper in here, but not much. She was a little smushed up, y'all. So I did stuff like a, just a little newspaper in here so y'all can see it real good. But yeah. And then I have this one here. She was completely smushed. And this is a plastic bag, y'all. As y'all can see, this is like some shiny, you know, this is like plastic. I don't know if y'all remember these bags back in the day, but... <laughs> I stopped telling her a long time ago. This is what the inside looks like. It ain't no newspaper or nothing like that in this one. Now, she was pretty smushed in that bin back there, y'all. I had to, like, try to push her out some, child. But this is the other bag that I will be giving away to whoever wants her, okay? So, when I ship these items out to y'all, uh, I'm going to try to ship them out in, like, a medium-sized box. Now, the wigs, I'm going to ship out in um the little uh packages at dollar tree because those are like you know flat so i don't have to put them in a box but these uh bags i will be trying to put them like in a box or something like that and ship them out to y'all now mind y'all i may end up taking the newspaper out of them so when y'all get the bag it may be a little smushed but y'all can just you know put some more newspaper in it once y'all get it to you know make her booth back out or whatever and then y'all could tote her whenever y'all feel like it or how you have a child but i'm just letting y'all know that i may end up taking all the newspaper out all these bags well actually these two before i ship them out okay so y'all let me know what items y'all want also one person per bag so i'm not gonna send one person two bags i'm just saying y'all i want it to be fair and i want to just ship things out to one person and i don't want to ship you know more than one item to one person if that makes sense i want everybody to be able to get something here okay so i will put the bags down below the wigs make sure y'all email me like i said and dm me if you got an instagram first call first serve so whoever dm me or email me first whoever i get to first i'm gonna let y'all know whether i still have the item or i'm gonna let y'all know that it's already gone 
okay so i'm just saying so don't y'all get mad at me if it's already gone okay so hopefully y'all make it this far to the video because a lot of y'all skip through my vlogs and y'all sometimes miss out on stuff like this okay so that's pretty much it y'all we're gonna wrap this up make sure y'all subscribe those that are new welcome and i want to say thank you to all of my old supporters that has been rocking with me for a very very long time i also want to thank a lot of you ladies that you know leave kind positive words up under my comment section y'all just don't know how good that makes me feel it motivates me to do more videos it motivates me period to just you know keep going and y'all are a blessing to me and i just want to thank you guys so very much for a lot of you guys is you know positive encouraging words that means a lot and um yeah that's pretty much it y'all so i know i will sit here and talk y'all head off and I, and I know y'all probably don't feel like hearing me talk that long <laughs> about how good and sweet y'all are to me when y'all leave positive you know comments up under my videos but anyways, um, like I said to my old babies, I love y'all dearly. And um, make sure y'all click that bell so you guys will be notified for this channel and my other channel. Now, for those that are not subscribed to my hair channel, please do me a favor and go ahead over there and subscribe, y'all, so y'all can catch some of those videos over there, babies. Yes. Let's see what else I got to tell y'all before I get off of here. I think that's it. I think that's it, y'all. Yeah, that's it. Mm-hmm, that's it. Well, I'm always praying for y'all, and hopefully y'all praying for us. I'm finna get off of here, y'all. And don't y'all know, I'm just now realizing I still got these shades on, child. <laughs> the whole entire video, since I made it in the house, I've been rocking these shades. <laughs> Girl, I know y'all probably be like, why can't Pooh got them shades still? Why she still got them shades on in the house? Anyways, y'all, I'm finna get off of here, y'all. So, I'll be back with more videos. Cheers! <laughs>